How do y'all welcome the Lex Lives? Whoa. <laughs> uh, I think it's time we play a little test pack, please ignore. So, I, uh, I updated our server. We're now on the uh, 1.03 pre-release. Uh, and, uh, I like to keep it up to date. Uh, usually I wait a day or two to make sure they got all the the bugs worked out. And, uh, I'm pretty sure we're experiencing some, uh, bugginess from the, from the, uh, update a little bit here. Um, oh, this is done. And, uh, uh, not me so far, but uh, it really looked like uh, one of the other players on the server was crashing the server. <laughs> I've had to reset it twice today, so uh, we'll have to figure out exactly what's going on. All my stuff looks pretty much the same. I uh, also updated my texture pack, so I can't tell what looks the same. I think this looks different. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe I'm hallucinating. I know the Ender Lilies here look different. Uh, I like that. This new look is pretty nice. Um, I added a, uh, a sludge drum. And you can see it is collecting sludge. 24,000 barrels. Uh, or 24,000 buckets of sludge, I guess that means. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, I had to add another barrel for potatoes because the, uh, <laughs> the I got a lot of potatoes. I'm probably going to have to stop the potato production altogether. Honestly, once, uh, once a barrel fills up, I'll probably just shut all this down uh, because I won't, I won't need it anymore, uh, at least for a while. Uh, I mean, I never use nether wart, so... I don't know that I really need another word. Don't use pumpkins. Don't really use the melons. Uh, occasionally I use sugar cane. Uh, and then potatoes are my main source of food, but I don't use that much food on here either. Ender pearls, though, those things I suck down by the gallon, it seems. Uh, and I went ahead and added a new section to the base. Uh, we're getting close to where rain can fall. I went out and I found, I found mystical flowers. This is what they look like. So we can start on Batania today. This is going to be my little Batania section. And uh, the, uh, I couldn't find a white flower. I'm not really sure I understand Okay, f I did not go watch any videos or anything, so I'm basically going into this blind. And, uh, like, I already made my book, so we're good there. And then we got some of the flowers. There's uh, 16 different colors, I think it says. And you can get petals by plucking the petals off the flowers. And you can grind them up in a pestle to make dye, um, which is pretty cool. Uh, and you can make them with bone meal. Turns out you just throw the bone meal down. And, uh, yeah, 16 different colors. So I didn't have to go hunting. I could have just ground up a bunch of bones and pitched them on the ground. Uh, oh. All right. I've got a bit of a cold. And uh, so I apologize for any sniffling I do. We're going to start with this Petal Apothecary thing, I think. We're going to try to make it. Uh, it's cobblestone slabs, and then cobblestone, and then one mystical petal. And that should get us our Petal Apothecary. So let's, uh, let's go get some cobblestone. Actually, do I have some on me? Mm, no. No, I do not. All right, well, I know where I keep keep this stuff, though. Just got to come up here, grab some cobblestone, 
like that. And then we're going to need some cobblestone slabs. I totally did not bring a flower with me. Uh, let's see. I got two. Oh, I got three. We'll use one of these. Uh, it's kind of funny. I, uh, I started, uh, building this over here and the, uh, the planter actually reaches over here and started planting ender pearls. I'm like, really? You won't do those three blocks right there, but you're going to go three blocks out this way? Seriously? Oh, yeah. See, I really like that new, that new top there. That's the first time I've seen one fully grown since I updated my texture pack. Still using the old Sortex Fanver. Uh, it's my favorite. I have tried a bunch of packs, and uh, this one, this one has the best look, I think, in my my personal opinion. I know a lot of people like um, oh, what's it called? A lot of people like the uh, faithful texture pack, but uh, I I like this a little better. Um, one of the people I was talking to said they thought it looked uh, cartoony. I don't, I don't get that. I don't like uh, if you look at Sapphix. I think that's the way that one spelled Sapphix, S A P H X or something like that. Sfax, it's Sfax, S P A S P H A X. No, yeah, S P H A X Sfax. <laughs> that one is cartoony. Uh, this one I think is just clean. Which I like. Where am I going? We're going to put down our, our thingy over here. Alright, let's put it right in the corner here. Bam. It's kind of weird looking. Put a bucket of water in here. Bam. I don't know. I don't know what that does for me. Alright, I made your petal apothecary. Now what? In order for a botanist to create plant life that can do its bidding, one would need special means of infusing plants with mystical energy. Luckily, the Petal Apothecary does just that. Petal Apothecary. This block, when placed in the world, will give some water, and given some water, will accept any mystical petals thrown at it, releasing their energies. Once one has set the correct petals in, throwing some seeds in will finalize the process. Tossing in the full bucket will also fill the recipient with water. Quite a few plants can be made using this method. For more information, read on the functional flora and generation flora sections of this lexicon. Psst. Those aren't sections. Those aren't sections in my book. Uh, all right, I'm apparently going to have to open up a wiki to figure out how to use this thing. I couldn't find this. The pure daisy is not only the most basic, but also the most important flower botanist can have. This flower will purify any adjacent wood and stone blocks, as seen on the next page, into their purified counterparts, living wood and living rock, which can be used for crafting. So I need to find or make one of those. Shift, click. Um, okay, so, so, all right. So there is a white flower, but to make that one, I have to have the white flower. Uh, I don't think I have enough, enough um, bones. I think I used up all my my bones, so we're probably going to have to go steal some. I'm sure... What is that? 
I'm sure that somebody somewhere has got a ton of bones. Uh, I do not. All right, let's let's go check. Whoa, I have like 13 levels too. What's up with that? Let's dump that in the old tank here. Whoops, didn't want to open the lexicon. Thanks. We're gonna go check uh, Short's place. He might have. He might have what we need. Yeah, I didn't set my jetpack up again. Alright, let's see. He usually has some kind of mob grinder, so... Machinery and storage. Oh, he changed his thing up. He got rid of the computers. That's okay, I like the buttons better. Uh, let's see. I need bones. Or bone meal. Bones. Oh, he's only got 39 bones. There, I'll leave him a bone. <laughs> Sorry, dude. I'm stealing all your bones. I don't know why you don't have more. Homecraft, Enchanted. Main floor. There we go. Figure out how to get back out of here. And then we just got to get to, uh, oh. oh, I forgot. I don't have fast speed swimming. I still haven't made the parts. Man, I, uh, put a cough drop in my mouth and it's making me really want to sneeze. Uh, okay. Bones into stacks on stacks of bone meal. Nope, I really thought I was going to sneeze there. I did not. Uh, and then... <laughs> I love this thing, man. It makes my life so much easier. So much easier. Uh, I'm going to put down some lights. Hopefully we're not too inconvenienced by the mobs. Okay. And I'm going to put it back on blower mode. And then we can throw down some bone meal, some Bone meal. Ooh, we got bone meal. Uh, we got one, but not the color I need. I need white ones. White. And then we blow it all away. Clean it up. Bone meal. Bone meal. Bone meal. I like these little brown plants that are popping up too. Ooh. A gray flower. Uh, all right, I don't see anything else. Poof. Yeah, this is really handy when dealing with uh, having to use bone meal. <laughs> oh, what's that? Blue hydrangea. I guess that's not special. Ooh, a dandelion puff. Dang it. I thought maybe that was one of the white flowers I need. So it's not too bad to get petals... But getting a specific color of petal seems to be kind of difficult. Oh, look, there's that orange. The mystical ones are pretty easy to tell, at least with the... Uh, I don't think it has a texture pack. I don't think it has a texture in my texture pack yet. So this is what it, uh, this is what it looks like without a texture pack. Um, I honestly don't remember it being in, in the... Uh, mod list before. It's, uh, I don't know when it got added. I didn't pay any attention. It must have got added in 1.2 maybe? Uh, 1.02? So, but I need the white flower because to, ooh, I don't think I have any of the red ones. Because to, uh, make some of the stuff, we've got to have one of those purified daisy things to make the living 
woods and stuff and uh, and like the living rock and if I don't have that hey buddy hey I am trying to I don't even have a weapon I am working here thank you Why don't you collect some of these seeds and then burn up in the sun? Oh, actually, it's quite a distance down to where you're at. Oh, he found a way up. <laughs> That's right, get dead. Punch you in the face. Blue hydrangea. See anything there? Ooh, look at that blue one. Come on. Just give me a white one. Actually, I need two white ones. Now, what are you? You're a white... I don't even know how to pronounce that. Anim uh, anemone? <laughs> uh, seeds everywhere. I wish the blow... The blower on the... Uh, gauntlet would actually blow stuff away. I totally blow all these seeds out of here. All right, let's get this uh, blue mystical flower. Um, nope, that's not a mystical flower. Not a mystical flower. Not mystical flower. There we go. All right, let's one more round, and then I will go check the wiki real quick for recipes what we can do I should have done it before I started recording but uh, I forgot I forgot I was so concerned about getting on here and getting my filming done before they crash the server again it looks like there might be something wrong with the universal cables from um, I want to say mechanism, uh, or at least the way he's got it set up is causing issues. Uh, all right, let me just pop over here to my other window. Botania Wiki. Ah. Uh, Um, weird, I don't see, yeah, I did that, I don't want to watch a video, can you just tell me, ooh, that looks awesome, oops, sorry, ooh, there's a, there's a, uh, thing that, uh, turns the mobs against each other and makes them fight each other. That seems cool, but where's... Where's... I don't want an animated look. Can we just... Oh, why does everything have to be a video? You ever get tired of that? Wanting to know how to do something and everything is a video and you just want a quick, here's a list... Else doesn't help that zombies are coming for me. Nope. No zombies, thanks. Okay. Um
Ooh. Interesting. Uh, it says the mana requires timing and aiming to get it to work. Uh, I guess we could go uh, make the wand and uh, and then I'll have to figure out how to actually do stuff with the flowers. I really need white flowers and whoops. And uh, so not having white flowers is a little annoying. All right, let's make a wand and we'll see about that. Uh, okay. See, the runic altar, uh, the runic altar requires living rock, which I've got to have the white daisy for, and this mana pearl or mana diamond, which is an ender pearl in a mana pool. Mana pool is made from living rock, which I don't have living rock. Uh, okay. Uh... Mana Steel. Cool. Mana Pearl. Mana Diamond. Mana Petal. Mana Cookie. <laughs> that shows how much mana they use there at the bottom. That's funny. Oh, that was all running altar stuff. So. Alright. Uh, mystical petals of any color with a few sticks. And the color of the petals will determine the color of your wand. Alright. So, let's make a black and blue wand, I guess. I've got black and blue on me. Uh, I just gotta go up and get some sticks. Oh, come on. Stop up in your head. Up and up and up we go. You know what? I should probably get rid of some of this stuff that I am not currently using. I don't need 21 books. I don't need... I found a town, so I took all their books, and I found a... a, uh, a really cool-looking um, temple that uh, was like in the side of a red clay biome. I thought it was pretty awesome. All right. You can go in there and uh, you can go in there. I think you can. Oh, you know what? We're actually clogged up on something. What are we clogged up on? Oh man, essence dust. Really? I got full, full barrel of essence dust. Uh, I'm out of barrels. I need to make new barrels. Here, just put some in there. Okay. Now we'll bust up a black one and a blue one. And then that was three sticks. I'll put a black petal and a blue petal. Bam. I now have a wand of the forest. I have no idea what it does, but I have one. <laughs> well, clicking on this stuff doesn't seem to do anything. Let's get these uh, flowers down here, though. For safekeeping. Oh, we picked up a couple of yellers. I like the red. That's pretty cool. 
No whites, though. Still no white. Why can't I have white? Why can't I have nice things? Uh, <laughs> uh let me see. Well, let me try another search here. Oops. Um... <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to go learn more about this mod pack. I thought it would be a little more intuitive. There's There's a uh... All they ever show is making the book I need to know how to use the pedals. Your book wasn't very clear. All right, so we got the wand. And everything else requires a pure daisy uh, to make the living rock. And it's, if I understand this correctly, it's, uh, you know what? What if we do this? Tanya. Anything in the game's got to be here, right? <laughs> Fallen Canada. <laughs> Canada. No, uh, Exoflame. Agricarnation. Where on the 25th of April? Oh, we missed that. Hopper Hawk. It funnels. It all funnels into it. Oh, that's weird. Orchids. I seed what you did there. <laughs> Tiger's eye. Hase. Hase. Kaur. I don't speak Japanese. Bellthorn. Jaded Amaranthus. A couple died for this. Rosa Arcana. Ten blue orbs in the corner. I don't get it. Thermalily. Hydroangels, that's funny. Indoflame, uh, Nightshade, Daybloom. Oh, that might be useful. Pure Daisy. Yeah, they don't they don't give me the recipes when I click on them. Oh, that one did. Living Rock. Yep, can't even do that. A Mana Pylon. Ooh. Mana Pool, Force Relay, Mana Void, Mana Detector. Black Unstable Beacons. Oh, those are all unstable beacons. Glimmering Living Wood. Oh. Living Wood and Glowstone. Interesting. Mossy. Oh, that's kind of cool. Ooh, those are nice looking. I want some of those. But I don't I don't know how to get to that point. Right here, this is what I need. I need the mystical white flower. That's all there is to it. I gotta have the mystical white flower to get the daisy, to get the the living wood I need. So, all right. Well, I will. Uh, I will continue to try and get some white mystical flowers, and uh, I will watch some videos, I guess, to figure this out for next time. And. Uh, I thought maybe we'd get a little farther today than we did. Unfortunately, I could not manage to get 
white mystical flowers anywhere. They're being... Oh, look, I didn't even get flowers this time around, practically. They're being coy. Come on, you know you want to be part of my setup here. I just need two of you, at least to get started with. If I can get one, one of those daisies going, I'll just put it in a spot where I can drop wooden rocks next to it. It should be okay, so... Man, nothing again. Alright. Click like if you like, subscribe, be sure and catch the next one, and I will talk to you... Oh man, I'm going to have to go hunt skeletons. I will talk to you later.